everyone, uh, we have actually have quite a big news update today uh, about Metroid Dread, the new Metroid game coming to Nintendo Switch. Of course, they announced it at E3, uh, and Nintendo has actually given us a brand new trailer, which we're going to be having a look at in just a second, and also Nintendo have announced that we're going to be getting a another update in a couple of weeks. Uh, in fact, less than a couple of weeks, on the August 27th, we're actually be getting another update. And it seems super, super exciting. So yeah, let's have a look at this trailer in just a second. Uh, but before we do that, though, make sure to hit that subscribe button, also like him, because it does really help us out. So yeah, we've got a brand new trailer, plus more information coming within the next couple of days as well. Very, very exciting time. Another thing that's super interesting is that Nintendo gave more of an update online on the website. Uh, we'll talk about that later in the video. Uh, but one thing they say is look forward to an upcoming game trailer uh, and more information on August 27th. Now, this could just be a trailer. This could just be something like, you know, another trailer, another news update, another report like we've seen today. That's probably what it's going to be like. You know, it's probably going to be another report or another trailer, but it could potentially be its own thing. We could potentially be seeing a Metroid Dread Direct. I don't know. Um, we don't really know what Nintendo does. They can be unpredictable. You know, we don't... We can... We sort of had hard game specific directs, you know, before. Um, so yeah, we'll have to wait and see. But we'll see another trailer on August 27th. Will it be a direct? We don't know. It could be. Unlikely, but it might be. Anyway, um, let's take a look at the brand new trailer they released uh, just a couple of hours ago. Um, so yeah, let's have a look. Alright, so here is the trailer. The brand new trailer uh, for Metroid Dread. I haven't seen this yet. I've just known it's a brand new trailer. What I've got to say is this does look actually looks beautiful. Not going to lie. Uh, like the the space themes and all that it does look very amazing. I believe this is a cutscene, uh, but yeah, it looks really really beautiful. Um, I believe the Samus Returns people are behind this one, so yeah, it seems super exciting. Um, this will probably be the opening cutscene, surely. Uh, but it's nice to see that Metroid's got some cutscenes. Oh, Samus! Is, I actually see Samus in the ship controlling the ship. Um, now this is interesting because hopefully it means that Metroid Prime 4 will look similar to this, so that's hopefully a bit exciting. Uh, but yeah, you know, you got to think, you know, these cutscenes, with the first one, we have, well, the last Metroid, Metroid 4, would have been on the uh, the GBA, so they wouldn't have had cutscenes, or at least big 3D ones like this, so it's great to see it. Um, I think this is kind of just setting the game up, to be honest, I don't think we'll see some gameplay, hopefully we will. Um, but yeah, I, I, what I've got to say is first, you know, first impressions, it looks beautiful, I have to say. Uh, I know it's only cutscenes, but right now it just it just looks really really good, and it kind of like proves that it is a big 3D Metroid, so very very exciting. Well, not 3D, but 3D in the sense of the models are 3D. Uh, it's a 2D Metroid in terms of its gameplay, but yeah, yeah, they're really going all out with this. It looks beautiful, of course, on the Switch OLED as well. Wow, I like Samus' new design for this as well. Yeah, looks really really nice. I'm actually like this is probably like my most uh, the game I'm most excited for uh, going into the end of the year. Wow, that looks amazing. Is that it? Is that all the trailers? Wow, okay, it doesn't really say much. It leaves uh, more questions than it does answers, but uh, that's not all. Nintendo's given us even more Metroid news. Yes, um, let's take a look at that. On the Nintendo website, there's actually um, there's some screenshots, actually some more information. If you want to read through that, there'll be a link in the description. Uh, but yeah, hopefully um, we'll hear more on August 27th. That's what it says on the website. Um, so hopefully we'll hear more about Metroid then. But yeah, out of all the Switch games that are coming out this year, I'm most excited for Metroid Dread. Um, Mario Party seems fun, but it seems very similar to Super Mario Party. Um, the Pokemon remakes, eh, I'm not a huge fan of that. Um, I don't know if I'll pick those up or not. We'll have to wait and see. Um, you know, I don't know. But um, it's whatever. BarioWare, I'll, I'll try and download the demo. I might do a, re a reaction video to that. We'll wait and see on that one. But um, yeah, Metroid, Metroid Dread seems to be my big game of the year. Um, I don't know if it'll be my game of the year. We have had some good games this year. But uh, yeah, we'll have to wait and see. We'll have to wait and see uh, what uh, Nintendo does with uh, Metroid Dread. But yeah, thanks for watching this video, everybody. If you if you enjoyed this video, then uh, let me know in the comments below. Let me know if you're going to be picking up Metroid Dread. Let me know your thoughts. And uh, until the next video, everybody, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Cheers for watching.